You sit in a room in the bar room with the same bloke crying on the bleeding wall and suddenly thin heaven and tell those children it's rude and oh Oshina, oh Avi Rana, or did not make it, but they would actually leave her get satisfaction questions and outrage that wind in the sails gets by its Jack Jones hearing in pens of resentment clock these bastards with pure feeling exploit their cheap plates but your horse and car bitchums pill breaks chicken penny a flock and little chase. See over and over. The Zeno Napoloni's private train is now coming into the station. And from a pink and white car, Napoloni and his wife will step onto a crimson carpet where Adenoid Hinkle will deliver his address of welcome. She's not shining white light at all, and she's climbing a mountain. Hey, what's all of this a mix up for? Come on, we're going too far. Alice, bring along the car. Papa, why can't we get out here? There is a door carpet. Here's about a car. Il Zigaricci, me and Apolloni. I never get out without a carpet. Is she really on? Satan's. Come on. Hey, it's going back again. What? What do you do, you salami? Let's get out, let's get out while it's stopping. Shut up. Interesting. What I want to ask you is what kind of music do you hear? <laughs> And now as a public service to those of our viewers who have difficulty with their hearing, I will repeat the top story of the day, aided by the headmaster of the New York School for the Heart of Hearing, Garrett Morris. <laughs> our top story tonight... Our top story tonight... Now, Lisa Mar Francisco, Francisco Franco is Franco still Franco dead. is still dead. Good night and have a pleasant Good night tomorrow. and have a pleasant tomorrow. <laughs> can be set free too. In fact, uh, we said earlier the whispering path we saw was Satan's path and then we're, we see her being told, dear lady, can you hear the wind blow? The pipe. And did you know your story lies in the whispering wind? I mean, you're going to hell. Okay, listen very carefully. They're cheering them fanatically, and he tells them that they've been, it's been a joke, basically. Listen carefully. My friend. Yeah, below me. I've seen them do that over and over. Okay. And we're not talking. Okay. And we're not. Okay. And then we're talking about. Listen carefully. Mr. Speaker, sir, the House meets this Saturday to respond to a situation of great gravity. We are here because for the first time for many years, British sovereign territory has been invaded by a foreign power.
quite obvious, and it's quite clear. It's really obvious what's going on here. He said you earn as much as Mrs. Thatcher. Is that true? How much she earn? Forty thousand? No, I mean I, I, I don't say. I don't say. Now listen to this. Yes, there are two. Did you hear that? Listen carefully. It says, I want to live it backwards like the Zep, whose power is Satan. Did you hear that? Then it says, He will give you, give you 666. <laughs> Not much into my albums anymore, so.